Georgi, better business environment stands on several structural reforms uh, that our partner international financial institutions have been thoroughly advising our government on for several mm. years now. And one such is definitely education. Before we will see some abstracts from your interview, uh, with a Georgian abroad who has turned education into a very successful business. Uh, let us see what Tatia Kakiashvili has pulled together for our viewers and followers. It turns out that the European School of Management and Technology uh, in Berlin is the leader among the five most popular universities among Georgian students in the 2020-2021 academic year. The rest comes from Tatia Kakiashvili in the checkpoints. Georgian students pay an average of 10, 15,000 euros a year to study abroad. Business administration and management programs are the top choice of the most popular professions. The situation created due to the global pandemic has significantly reduced the number of educational tourists from Georgia. According to the Education Consulting Agency, Prime Study, the European School of Management and Technology in Berlin is the leader among the five most popular universities among Georgian students in the 2020 2020 academic year. It is followed by Instituto Europeo di Design, Milan, Italy, IECEG School of Management, Paris, France, Land University, Land, Sweden, and Kyoto University of Advanced Sciences, Kyoto, Japan. As David Micheladze, the founder of Prime Study Education Counseling Center, told us, tuition fees at foreign universities vary by location and curriculums. They are like different price ranges. Like, for example, traditionally, United States is the most expensive destination and the price of the tuition, accommodation and living costs can reach up to tens of thousands of US dollars. More affordable destination, which I think like is in demand of Georgian students in recent years, is Western European countries. This is France, Germany, Italy, Netherlands, where the price is more affordable and the like, uh, cost benefit uh, value of it is in, in reach of Georgian customers. As David says, studying in countries like Hungary and Czech Republic is more affordable and the prices are lower for Georgian students. Also, they apply for scholarship if available. It's difficult to speak about the total number of Georgian students who are studying abroad, but talking from the experience of Prime Study, the company is helping on average 30-35 students per year to go abroad for studying. Like other businesses, COVID-19 had a negative impact on the activities of Prime Study. According to Mikeladze, many students wanted to go abroad during the pandemic and study, but they postponed these plans due to the pandemic. Besides lockdowns, tow economic situation and lower purchasing power of the GEL are additional factors that to him create additional obstacles for those wishing to study abroad. Major challenge is that students cannot travel abroad in most of cases and the classes like particularly from the beginning of pandemic classes were offered in like a virtual uh, format like students were sitting in Georgia or elsewhere and taking classes online. Obviously this was a, like only available solution at the start of the pandemic but luckily nowadays like schools have moved back to traditional like uh, studying format so the biggest impact to return back to your question was that like students could not travel could not enjoy this like one-to-one -one interaction with their faculty and fellow students and this was the biggest problem travel restrictions should also be considered after the first shock of the pandemic, David Michelazzi's expectations for the 2021-2022 academic year are quite positive. He thinks that next year the global pandemic can no longer be a significant impediment to those wishing to study abroad. We are BMG. Follow and subscribe for business and economics news.